What's up guys? Just doing a, honestly a second video in one day so that's pretty cool. Uh, I'm going to do another little unboxing of, this was only like five bucks and it was from my buddy, he owns a card shop in Harrodsburg. Uh, shit, I wish I knew the name of the card shop so I could at least give him a shout out. Uh, I didn't even think about that. I'll give him a shout out, I'll do a little video. Uh, just do a video just doing a shout out for him but I've been wanting one of these it comes with like a little card binder and a pack of cards it was only like five bucks and he honestly just hooked me up he's just like here you go you know uh, he said next time I'm in town just slip him a slip him a Lincoln but yeah so it comes with a little binder I don't know which Pokemon that is. That one, I bought this pack because, I don't know, I like that werewolf dude. I can't remember his name, but, yeah, it's just a little small card sleeve binder. And I thought it was cool, you get a pack of ten cards and a little binder. It was only like five bucks, I was like, yeah, fuck yeah. But yeah, it's uh, Sun and Moon, um, Guardians Rising, so let's see what I got. Hopefully I got him because that's who I really want. Let's see, Gothita. I don't like that art style. They made like toys and then like they're like clay models and then took a picture of it out in the actual wild. I think it looks lame. Uh, Pat Brad, I already have one of them. Carvana, I've never seen him before. Cottony is pretty much, which I have a fairy deck now, so I'll be able to use it. What's up, boo? What's up, boo? I was doing, Cottony. I did a little unboxing. Yeah, that's a Bell Sprout classic. Okay. This ain't a classic card, but Generation 1. Got a Reverse Hollow of that dude. Lampant. Misty of all form of what? Uh, wick, wick. You got an energy. I can always use energies. Can't have enough energy. See? Ooh, this one's cool. Uh, I've actually, I've been wanting one in general, so that works out. Yeah. There's a, here in Kentucky, there's a place called Hopkinsville, and there's actually like a UFO account, which is what they base this card uh, artwork on. It's, look it up. It's Hopkinsville Goblins. It's a UFO account, pretty much. Hins. Hopkinsville? Uh-huh. Yeah. Yeah, there's that S there. Hopkinsville Goblins. And look it up. It's actually pretty interesting. It's only like, what, like an hour and a half, two hours away from here? Yeah. We're, we're going to make a video going out and visiting it if we can find the actual... Pretty much, it was like this cabin... And everyone was there was drinking, so it was a farmhouse. Yeah, it was a farmhouse, so no one knows if they just did it for like popularity or just whatever, or they were just drunk on drunk on moonshine or whatever. But a flying saucer landed supposedly, and all these goblins came out and were climbing on the roofs and. These these two redneck dudes just went buck wild, started shooting through their windows, shooting them. Supposedly they did they kill a couple of them. They said. No, they never got to kill any. Yeah, there wasn't honestly much evidence. Well, there was actually there was that account back in like the forties, right? And then didn't they come back like years later? It was the fifties that it happened in like nineteen fifty five. Yeah. And then they came back. Yeah, later in early 2000s, and right. now possibly even later after that. Yeah, but that's what this artwork is based off of, the whole little sable eye. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to definitely put him in a sleeve, because I've been wanting him for a while. And I that's my first time I'm getting him. Uh, I got a multi-switch. I've never seen one of those. Move an energy from uh, one of your bench Pokemon to your active Pokemon. So, so yeah, there you go. Pangoro. 
is the evolved form of Pantons. Yeah, and then Sligood's kind of like a like a snail, pretty much. Slug. But it looks like it has bunny ears, which is weird. That's dragon mm -hmm. type. Most of these I can't really use, probably, but it's, I don't know. I wanted to, honestly, for the binder, too. So, for five bucks, man, and I'll, I'll do another shout, I'll do a shout out video to his card shop, that way, I'll do like a little commercial video, so that way he can get some business, you know, maybe he'll hook me up with a free pack or something, you know, which, he was, he's an old buddy that I worked with years ago, and hell, my wife needed energies, and how many energies did he give you for free? Pretty much 20. Yeah, just gave her 20 energy cards for free just like here you go because me and him go way back he's just a cool guy uh so i'll do another video giving him a little shout out um but yeah two videos in one day they're both pokemon videos hopefully you guys like and subscribe hit me up in the comments what you think about whatever if you guys want to talk pokemon Yu Gi Oh or magic whatever if you want to compliment the channel or just honestly just talk to me in general. Like, I love talking to people. But y'all have a good night. I'll catch y'all on the flip side.